convex and concave mirror. For that, as a substitute, we're gonna use a ladle that is extremely shiny, which will hopefully work well, and our object. As you can see, our object is is a cat. Uh, and this is the bottom which is slightly beige and the top is white so remember that great so we're going to start our experiment now we need a stand for that i'm just going to use my pencil uh, uh, stand and we're going to keep the mirror there so we'll start with concave as you can see it curves inwards concave as the name suggests and we're going to see how the image formed okay so i'm going to take the object right and there can you see can you see the object the object appears to be inverted as in its ulta the top is up and the up is uh, down and you can see us as well we are upside down we are not uh, uh, we are attracted to gravity i mean gravity is acting on us and as you can see this image is appearing inverted but when you bring it close right bring it very close ah there can you see it appears um, erect that is how we see it in real life great so with that we established that the concave mirror produces mostly an uh, inverted image but when close to the pole it uh, produces an erect image and next we're on to the convex mirror which is curving outwards we're going to use this and uh, you may already be able to guess that since we are also standing uh, uh, normally, our object is also going to behave in a similar way. Okay. So when we move it towards, yeah, this light falling on it. One minute. Yeah, and as you can see, our cat appears. Our cat appears to be. Right, on a convex surface. So with that we conclude our experiment and that is the image formed by a concave surface uh, is usually um, um, inverted. <laughs>